Oh my god, I just had like the biggest burp right before I started filming. <laughs> I actually have like a burping problem. Yo, I don't even like that word, but that's what it is, I guess. Is like belt? No, not a belching problem. I don't know. I burp a lot though when I edit it out of all my videos. And it's not like on purpose. I just have like bad acid reflux. I think I've talked about this before. I can't remember honestly, but my burps are kind of ridiculous. Just a little bit. <laughs> I've kept them in sometimes, but usually I edit them out because again, ridiculous. <laughs> but whatever. It's it's jack <laughs> oh my gosh i got my nails done the other day and they're green obviously they're like sparkly but they look blue at some angles can you guys tell i really wanted to get holiday nails because you know today is or no today is november 1st i almost said october 1st today is november 1st which means it's officially christmas time i got my nails done um, Sunday, which was two days ago, and I almost got holiday nails, but I was like, oh, I don't know. Maybe I should settle for something a little less holiday-y. So I went with green, but it changes to blue. So it's kind of festive, but not like too much, you know, because I didn't want to get like red and gold or nothing like that. So I went with this, and I like it a lot. But anyways, today, I'm sure y'all can tell we're doing an unedited sesh and I feel like I haven't done one of these in a fat minute. You guys have been telling me to do one for a while now. And anytime I'm like, what video should I do or any recommendations, you guys are always like, unedited sesh. And I'm like, okay, but I haven't done it yet. So here I am. And I also haven't posted a video in like two weeks, I think. And that's just because I've been really busy. I did a crochet drop three days ago, four days ago on Saturday. And planning those drops is just like kind of a lot for me just because I'm like new to it and like getting all the items ready, like crocheting them takes a while, especially because it's just me. I'm not like the fastest crocheter in the world. So that kind of takes a while. And then actually like taking all the pictures posting them getting the captions together like it's like it's a uh, it's actually a lot more than like i thought it would be when i before i even started doing it but now that i've like done it two times the first time was like super stressful i almost like didn't end up doing it because i was like oh my god this is really str really stressful like what if nothing even sells but then it went really good and then the second drop I was just putting off and putting off because I started school around the same time that I wanted to drop it, which wasn't smart. I probably should have done it beforehand, <laughs> but I didn't have all the items ready. And so, oh no, I'm losing my train of thought and I'm not even high yet. Yikes. And so, <laughs> no, what am I talking about? Oh yeah. And so I started school and then I just kept putting the drop off as like school is getting busier. And then I was like, okay, I need to do this drop at least before Christmas time, you know? And I ended up doing it at the very last possible moment, which kind of sucks. I like barely even promoted it to. I literally announced the drop like five days before it happened. Talked about it like two times. Thought it was gonna do really bad and all the items still sold. So that makes me happy. But in the future, I need to stay on top of things more and stay more organized and not like take care of everything like the week before because <laughs> that was just too much this drop I would just was not prepared last drop I at least like promoted a little bit more but this drop I literally like got everything ready except like the crocheted items like the week of so yeah I don't know I don't know where I was going with that oh yeah why I haven't posted. <laughs> ah, gosh. I have been hanging out with my mother. We were watching Bad Mom's Christmas and I have been smoking with her. So I have, I'm not sober right now. <laughs> but, um, 
yeah the crochet drop in school and I honestly just I had a ton of videos planned for like a whole month from like mid-september to mid-october and then I didn't have like anything planned after that also so that's also another reason why I haven't posted just because I haven't had anything like planned kind of think of anything to post I guess I don't know I've just been doing stuff but I do have multiple videos planned for the next month well for the next couple weeks kind of got some unboxings some vlogs so that's cool I went to the pumpkin patch the other day and vlogged that but I haven't started editing it so I don't know I don't know if that's can I don't know I don't know if that's gonna be a vlog we'll see but I think I should stop chatting and get into this joint I picked up a supers by juicy joints pre-roll for my dispo it's the f oh my gosh what am i saying <laughs> the strain is tiger's blood and it has a crumble distillate and keef in it so yeah that's great i've had these before and they're really good especially this flavor the tiger's blood one this flavor <laughs> this strain like it tastes really good I love it. I also got sick a couple weeks ago. Like, was it last week or the week before that? I can't remember, but my boyfriend got kind of sick. And then my mom got sick, but she was like a different sick than he was. Like, they both had colds. They didn't have COVID, but they both had like some sort of just like common cold. But my mom seemed to be a little bit worse. I feel like when my mom gets sick, she just gets like really bad sore throats, her sinuses get really bad. Like I feel like when she gets a cold, it's like a cold to the max. And so, and then I got sick and like, I felt like it was kind of a combination of both of them. But like when I get a cold, I get body aches and like my boyfriend doesn't. And like, I feel like my mom does sometimes, not all the time, I don't know. I think they both got me sick and then And then what? I don't even know where I was going with that. And then I was sick for a couple days. I don't, yeah, I don't know. That's why I haven't posted. Another reason why I haven't posted. I've just been going through it. I can't open this. <laughs> Come on. Am I gonna need skizzers? I really don't wanna get up. Oh. Nope, here we go. I'm just sliding the thing off. There we go. Okay. Chino's meowing outside my door, but I don't want him in here right now while I'm smoking this joint. I haven't smoked a joint in a minute. Mmm, it already smells good. I think the last time I smoked a joint was like August. Yeah, I think August, and that was... Gino, no, give me like time. <laughs> what, like two months ago? Something like that. It's kind of a little dented at the bottom. Oops, all right. <sighs> I feel like I still have some post nasal drip from when I was sick. You guys don't want to hear about that. Okay, cheers. Ooh. Mmm, <laughs> that's so yummy. Oh my god, it's so good. Like, actually, I don't know what they do with this strain, but it's so delicious. Chino is yelling at me because I won't let him in. Give me a little bit of time, bro. <laughs> I told y'all on my Instagram story to give me some things to talk about and I honestly can't really remember what you guys told me. Somebody said weed. Yeah. <laughs> I think somebody said like my top five, talk about my uh, to talk about my top five favorite strains. And my least five, or no, my, 
my worst, I don't know. And why? Chino's literally digging at my door trying to get in. I'd say my favorite strains at the moment are... Hmm... Cushmints, Danny DeWito, Why can I like not think of any strains right now? I don't know guys. Did I say Cushman's? <laughs> I think I did. I think that was the first one I said. Huh. I don't know. Somebody said aliens and I think I've talked about aliens before on my channel. Like in my conspiracy theory sesh video that I did a while ago. But I think I... <sighs> Chino is making loud noises. Because now him and Callie are chasing each other. Gosh. But I think I talk about how I think they're real. Because I do. Because how can we, us dumb humans, be the only things out there? If you think that we're, tr you're tripping. Not we're tripping, cause I don't think that you're tripping. <laughs> I don't think they're like crazy looking though. I mean, maybe they are, maybe they look way different than us. But I feel, I feel like they probably look the same as this. Maybe a little cooler. I don't know, honestly. What I have in my mind right now is like a person going with like Squidward arms, like a person with Squidward arms. Like, you know, in that one like episode where he's like dancing. Yep, that's what I'm picturing. But I don't know if that's what aliens look like. <laughs> Does anybody? I don't know. Did I tell you guys I decorated for Christmas today? Cause I did. I'm so happy about it. I'm honestly very happy that Halloween time is over. I, did I say that? I'm very, I'm honest, I am honest. I said that, right? <laughs> like I was super excited for Halloween, but then like, I don't know, the last like two weeks, week? I was just over it. I was like, heck no, I wanna watch The Grinch, How the Grinch Stole Christmas, I wanna watch Elf, Polar Express, I wanna watch everything, but I can't because it's not Halloween time. And I have a rule that I can't watch Christmas movies until it's Christmas time. Did I say the wrong thing just then? Did I say I can't watch them because it's Halloween time? Or no, because it's Christmas time? No, I said I think, I think I said I can't watch them because it's Halloween time. And then I started talking about my I think. Oh my gosh. I need to not try to go back on what I was talking about because I don't... It just won't work. Ugh. This joint's nice. <laughs> I haven't smoked one in a long time, like I said. I feel like I'm definitely a bong gal though. Like I love just a nice bowl. Does the job. <laughs> I don't have to keep putting it into my mouth. I feel like I like joints in a social setting. And I have friends. Or just, you know, somebody else just <laughs> <coughs> I 
I don't know if your guys' TV does this, but I have like um, Xfinity and when I'm like not watching TV for a while, it'll just start like going through like a slideshow of pictures from all over the world. Granted, I should probably just have my TV off because I'm not watching TV. I'm just looking at the pictures, but they're fun to look at. <laughs> it's like a new picture every like five to 10 seconds. And they're from like all over the world. Like that one's Italy. Val de, Fun Val de Funes, Trentino, Al uh, uh, okay, it already changed. This one's Venice Beach. Venice Beach, California, United States. Isn't there an episode of Victorious when they go to Venice Beach and then they get locked in an RV? Is that the episode or am I thinking of something else? I wanna go there. I wanna go to all the like classic California beaches. When I went to Disneyland, I went to Newport Beach and I thought it was awesome. I loved it. It was exactly what I pictured. <laughs> cute classic little beach town <laughs> very cute <coughs> what else did you guys tell me to talk about you guys told me to talk about thanksgiving plans i think this is what i do for thanksgiving pretty much every year i go to my nana's and we have thanksgiving dinner and we also celebrate the November birthdays, which is usually just my cousin's birthday. Because <laughs> her birthday is like right around Thanksgiving. Sometimes it's not Thanksgiving. It's the 27th, actually. So, right? It's not the 26th. It's the 27th. I'm going to be pissed if that's wrong because I can't edit this out. Ugh, that's not wrong. But anyways... Thanksgiving slash birthdays kind of birthday party and then usually my cousin and I have a sleepover and we go black friday shopping the next day we've been doing this for like 10 years now at this point I think maybe nine I think we started doing it around like 2012 2013 We've been doing it for a while, like sleepover every year and then Black Friday shopping. Last year, actually, though, we kind of changed it up and we still had a sleepover, but we hung out with all of my other cousins and drank a lot of beer. I didn't really. I think I had like, I think I shotgunned like two beers and I was like, I'm good. That was like my first time ever shotgunning and really drinking beer, which I already knew I didn't like beer. So I don't know why I would shotgun, probably just because I wanted to have fun with my cousins and not be lame. Um, so yeah, they all, they all got way more lit than me because they all like live in the dorms and get turned. I, I don't, you guys know me. I just smoke my weed. <laughs> But, you know, we all hung out last Thanksgiving and shotgunned some beers. And then we smoked weed together. That was so fun. That was our first cousin smoke sesh with all of us together. And we were all like, isn't this kind of crazy that it's just now happening? <laughs> but that was a lot of fun. And then my cousin and I still had our sleepover and went black friday shopping the next day so that was great and maybe we'll do the same thing this year i honestly don't know i haven't talked to her to see what the plans are but for sure going to my nana's and having dinner and i am making the green bean casserole oh yeah i make good bean bean casserole no i make good green bean casserole i mean it's not my recipe it's like campbell's or something <laughs> but i i think i do a great job <laughs> and i'm excited to make it oh my gosh that same italy picture is back up and now it's venice beach again i feel like i'm traveling back in time <laughs> Mm 
let me know down below what your guys' Thanksgiving plans are. Because I want to know. I think my cousin told me to talk about Fortnite. Not the cousin I was just talking about, a different cousin. <laughs> I actually used to play Fortnite on my phone a lot when it came out on mobile. I don't think I've ever played it on... No, that's actually such a lie. I've definitely played it on Xbox before, but I don't think I'm that... Well, I know I'm def... Not now... Oh my god. Now I'm definitely not good at it, but back then, even when I would play it, I still wasn't that good. <laughs> I don't think I've ever gotten a victory royale, unfortunately. Not even in teams or like duos or whatever. When I used to play though, I wouldn't really do anything. I would just like hide in a bush and run around. I was one of those people. <laughs> oh, this joint's starting to burn my throat. Yeah, it's... Ah. Ooh, ah, ah, ah. Oh my gosh, you guys want to see my big bag of caramel corn? This thing is so good. Oh my god, I should pose for a thumbnail. <laughs> this is the dumbest thumbnail ever because I'm not even eating my caramel corn. Did I say candy corn? It's caramel corn. Unedited sesh. Ah. <laughs> I think that was the thumbnail right there. Oh. When I first started, like, well, <coughs> I honestly don't even know. I don't know when this started to happen, when I stopped doing this. I used to remember that I need to get a thumbnail and I would actually, like, post through thumbnails. I mean, I still do it sometimes, but I feel like I used to do it a lot more. I don't know where I just kind of stopped remembering. I've been trying to remember a little bit more, but I've been having to YOLO with the thumbnails a little lately. Ah, <laughs> oh, because I forget about them. And then I don't pose, which I mean I don't need to, but it makes it a lot easier for me in the long run. I thought there was something on my sleeve, but it's literally the design. Oh yeah. Oh my god, a lot of you guys told me to talk about my favorite music and then I was like why is nobody asking me to talk about T Swift and then somebody was like talk about T Swift and I was like yes ha 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 guys okay so I used to fuck with T Swift when I was little <laughs> like the love story you belong with me white horse mean that whole era i really fucked with t swift back then when all those songs were really pumping and i also liked her red album too like i remember um like 22 i knew you were trouble never we are never getting back together um a lot of those songs on her album i remember like when that album came out, my little 11 year old heart was just like, oh yeah, this is wonderful. I think I was 11 when that album came out. Oh my God, was I? When did that album come out, like 2012? Because I would have been 11 then, I don't think. I think the cats are messing with the tree. I see, that was 20, no, that was 10 years ago though. That doesn't seem right. Somebody correct me. I mean, I'm going to look it up after this anyways, but somebody tell me in the comments anyways. But I loved T-Swift back then, and then I stopped listening to her. Like, I didn't listen to her Lover album, is that what it's called? Or like, Reputation, really, or, um, 1982? No. That what it is? I don't know. Or like folklore, Everlore. I don't listen to in Evermore, Everlore. Mm, see, I like I don't even know. 
I didn't listen to any of those albums. I mean, I know some songs from them, but like when they came out, I wasn't like, ooh, so excited. Or like, oh my gosh, t Swift came out with a new album. I would, like, I was, I just found the songs because they were popular and I was like, oh shit, it's t Swift, you know? You guys get what, I, what I'm saying? Basically, I wasn't paying attention to t Swift. <laughs> I, I can't talk, talk, oh my God, I can't call her Taylor Swift because t Swift is too good of a name. But I think my joint's going out. That's fine because I'm talking too much right now. I need to get this story out before I continue smoking. But I watched her documentary two months ago. I think two months ago. And I was like, whoa. T Swift. Awesome. And then I found out that she was coming out with a new album. <laughs> oh my god. See you guys, this is what I'm talking about. That was like building up for a minute. But, um... T-Swift. <laughs> Saw that she was coming out with a new album and I was like, yes! I bet it's gonna be epic. I stayed up till... When did it come out? Like 9pm Pacific time? I stayed up till it came out and the first song, Lavender Haze, I was like, oh, T Swift, this is kind of a banger, well, kind of a banger. And then the next song played, what was it, Maroon? <laughs> I like that one even more. And then a couple more songs went by and then Midnight. Rain. <laughs> well, I, I think it's so funny how I don't even know the name to my favorite song. I think it's Midnight Rain. <sighs> I love that song. I think that song is so good. I don't understand how it's not the most popular. I love it. I think it's so awesome. And there's a couple of other songs that I really like on there too. But I'm sure most people like... Because how can y'all not? But basically what I'm trying to say is that I am in my Swifty era again. I posted that on my Instagram story yesterday because when I opened up Spotify to listen to the new podcast that, um, oh my God, I feel bad that I don't even know their real life names. Artie and Tina from Glee, they started a podcast and I started listening to it yesterday and I really like it. But um, that's not important right now. I opened Spotify up to listen to their podcast. And when I did, this notification popped up that told me I was in the first 1% of streams for midnight. And I don't know if that's true or not because I've been seeing a lot of people say that. So I think they're just sending that to everybody to make them feel special. But either way, it made me feel special, so they did a good job. And I posted it on my Instagram story and said I'm in my Swifty era again. And it's facts. <laughs> I, I saw today that she's actually going on tour soon, and I kind of... That's actually like... I'm not into stadium tours really that much, just because I like more like smaller general admission concerts where you can like get close or if you want you know i have been to stadium concerts actually no the only stadium concert i've ever been to was metallica and that was cool actually because i got to like look at all the mosh pits and crazy shit going down in general admission so i guess that probably was a good concert to have seats in but i'm not usually a seat kind of person for concerts and especially being so far away like i don't want the person to look like a ant but I've been kind of thinking that would maybe be a fun concert to go to. But it's probably going to be so hard to get tickets. I'm not even going to think about it. Because getting tickets is probably going to be impossible. So. <laughs> I think that probably will happen. But I still love the album. It's so wonderful. In my opinion. I think it's good. So yeah. That's my thoughts. 
at the moment. That's what I can think of about the new <laughs> T-Swift album. Do you think she likes being called T-Swift? <sighs> Sorry guys, I had to. I feel like she probably does. I don't know. I'm, I don't know enough about Taylor Swift to know if she's cool with that or not. I'm sure some hardcore Swifty is going to tell me in the comments or whether or not she does. <laughs> okay. <coughs> it's 1030 and I have this much left. Let's see how much I can do. And it's been half an hour. Oh boy. I have no idea when I'm gonna post this. I wanted to tomorrow, but I need to study for my midterms. Ah, I have two midterms tomorrow. Back to back. <sighs> oh my god, I look like I was horse lips. That was funny. <laughs> like you're in, you know, you guys know that episode of iCarly where they do the slow mo. That's what it reminded me of. But yeah, two midterms tomorrow. Back to back. First one's at 1.30 p.m. Second one is at 3.40 p.m. And I need to study for both of them before. Both of them. And I already studied a little bit today. So I shouldn't have to do too much tomorrow. But... I do. <laughs> Actually. I don't even know what I'm saying. I mean, I don't have to do a shit ton. But I still need to finish filling out like my 3 by 5 note card my first midterm because we can have a little tiny note card only one side of it though yikes uh, i hope i can finish this whole thing <laughs> i'm starting to get tired and worn down this is kicking my butt oh gosh i'm Getting ash all over the place. Somebody was like, please make this video an hour. And I was like, <laughs> I'd love to for you guys, but shit, I don't know if I can do that. <laughs> Maybe if I was crocheting or something. Oh yeah, definitely if I was crocheting, but I'm not. Mm -hmm. Should I do another crochet sesh soon? I haven't done one of those in a while. I didn't tell if you guys liked the crochet content or not, so I kind of cut back on it a little bit. But hey, if you guys want it, I'll give it to ya. <laughs> I just don't know. I got a comment on one of my- I just remembered this. I got a comment on one of my videos today that was like, if you think about it and take away the camera, She's just talking to voices in her head. And all I could think of was, have you never watched YouTube before? <laughs> Isn't that like what every, every YouTuber does? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I'm not, I mean, I guess I'm kind of talking to voices in my head because I'm, when I ask you guys questions, I hear imaginary responses. But at the same time, I'm not because I'm talking to you guys. You guys eventually see it and give me responses. So <laughs> that comment was just so silly to me. I was like, what? Sorry, my legs were just hurting. I needed to stretch them out. But now I'm laying at like, like a 170 degree angle. It's just kind of odd. But... No, dang it, not again. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, I need to not let it go out anymore because I need to just power through. <coughs> My throat is burning though. Maybe I should drink some more water before. I 
Uh, oh my gosh, I drank my feather. Uh, I drank my first glass of wine the other day. Well, of rose. <laughs> My mom got some rosé for me to try because I have been watching The Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, as I think I've mentioned to you guys. And my favorite housewife is Lisa Vanderpump and she loves rosé. So I wanted to try it. And mm, it wasn't my fave. It literally took me like two hours to finish, but I did it. I'm gonna force myself to like it because I wanna be a rosé gal rosé all day mm-hmm <laughs> okay i need to do this i need to finish this joint there's that much left god dang it i'm getting so much ash all over my brand new not brand new freshly washed bedding ah it's fine it's okay I'm tired. <laughs> oh, and I didn't dress up for Halloween, guys, unfortunately. If I was anything, I was just Jack. but I'm not every day. <laughs> oh my gosh, my throat is burning. So bad. It's on fire. Ah! I don't know guys, I don't know how much longer I can go for because this is just hurting. It's hurting a lot. I'll start ghosting. Oh yeah. So that didn't hurt. I don't know about you guys, but I can't ghost without puffing my cheeks out before. Oh my god, I have a hair in my nose. I got it. And I've gotten comments before too that are like, oh my god, why does she puff her cheeks out? I'm like, bro, because I got it. <laughs> <laughs> and what about it? <laughs> Mind your business. Ah, <laughs> I don't know guys, I don't know how much longer I can go. I'm starting to get hot also. I feel like it's not even getting any smaller. I feel like it's been the same size for the past like four rips. Oh my God, I feel like I still have a hair in my nose. Am I just tripping? I don't know. <laughs> I was straightening out my septum. That's what that was. You can hear the rain. It's raining outside. It literally didn't start raining in Washington until like two weeks ago. We're a little behind this year. guys I think I got a tap I got you roaches are hard for me to smoke people are probably gonna be like oh my god that's not even a roach it is to me <laughs> once it starts burning and hurting ooh, I gotta go <laughs> but wow this was a lot of fun I forgot how fun these were 
I feel like sometimes I get like nervous before I do one because I'm like, oh my gosh, what am I going to talk about? But I always, I figure it out. It always ends up fun. Ah, so yeah, I should start doing these more often. I'm sure you guys wouldn't mind. <laughs> but I'm going to go because it's been 40 minutes now. It's 10.45. Wow, Greenland is on my screen now, but it's all ice. Isn't that funny? Of course it is. I'm gonna go. Okay. I love you guys so much. Stay safe. Make good choices. Cherish your loved ones. I'll see you guys in the next one. I was trying to think if there is anything else I want to say. But I don't think there is. So I love you guys. <laughs> Bye, friends. Smoke weed every day.